Looking at today like a historian, you might say, America and their Zionist colony seemed to believe in the mid-2020s that violence was a magical formula that had no downside. However, uh, Israel's unhinged attacks against their enemies uh, depleted not only their own reputation internationally, their own military capabilities, their own economy, uh, the security of their own citizens who are increasingly opting to uh, leave Israel amidst the conflict, uh, it also depleted their own historical rationale for their aggression and violence. If you do not see how everything happening today constitutes the downfall of Israel and the downfall of America playing out in real time, uh, then you're blind, either by emotion or by indoctrination. The way empires rise is also the way they fall. America rose by colonial settler violence and expansion, and Israel is just a microcosm of that. They, they, they rose by belligerence and brutality and genocide, and this is exactly what's bringing them down now. Yes, it is violent. Yes, it is savage. Yes, it is criminal and horrific, and it's incredibly painful. But it's like water draining out from a pool. It moves faster uh, and more violently at the bottom of the vortex until it disappears. What we're seeing now, in my opinion, is the dying spiral of American empire, and Israel is the drain that it's going down.